This is it. It's very crappy. Maybe you should unwind after the flight. Maybe take a shower. That might be more tempting if you were here. That might have to wait until we aren't fugitives from our own government. A man can dream, though. A man can dream. why I love you. You can send roses to my dead drop in Prague. Now that you've made it to Taipei, what are your plans? Priority one is to find out more about this assassination attempt. Agreed. How are you going to go about it? I've got three leads to start with. This Stephen Heck guy seems like he knows what's going on in Taipei. He might be able to answer some questions. Be careful, Mike. I've checked my databanks, and I can't find any evidence that Stephen Heck has ever worked for the CIA. I'll be on my guard. There's also that anomalous data trail from Shahid's system. Any luck tracing it down? I managed to follow it back to a place in the warehouse district. I'm forwarding the address to you now. What's the final lead? Simple. Follow the money. Shahid was funneling large amounts of money to a front corporation for the White Oak Mountain Triad. I think I can persuade them to tell me why. Sounds like you've got everything figured out. Isn't that why you love me? You watch yourself out there, Mr. Thornton. Always. Darcy. He wrote, Mike and Sean, fuck yeah! With three exclamation points. In a sec, buddy. Not too uncomfortable, I hope. Now this, this is dry cleaning solution. Active ingredient is perchloroethylene. Get stains out like a champ. Like a champ when, believe you me. Gonna be hard getting that stuff down his throat. Want me to get a funnel? A funnel? Yeah, that's a killer idea. So you remember where they are now, do you? Candy. 
Yeah, that does it, Wen. You know I don't like sweet. Oh, the candy dish! That's right! That's where I left my keys. Should have said something earlier, Wen. You see what I almost made you drink? <laughs> Good old Wen. Always getting into antics. Anywho, what can I do you for? I like your style. Do any of the people you've interrogated know anything about an attempt on Sung's life? You came to the right place, and you're lucky you did. See, people come in and out of Taipei all the time without asking for clearance, so then I have to erase them so they don't expose me. Now that sounds dangerous. When you say expose, what do you mean? My secret identity and everything I know, that's what. Listen, did you know that in the 1960s, the CIA surgically jammed a mic and antenna into a cat for an op codenamed Acoustic Kitty? No, I've never heard that. Have you heard of anything relevant to my previous question? Oh, it's relevant. Just between you and me. And when? You're with the agency, am I right? I'm with an agency, but U.S. tax dollars don't keep the lights Really? Out. SIS? Office of Secret Intelligence, Majestic 12, TVC 15, oh, wait, EPA. Something like that. Yeah, I work for a division of the CIA that doesn't officially exist. Super secret. They just kind of turned me loose and let me go nuts. Uh-huh. So, can you help me or not? Depends. How do I know you are who you say you are? I have to ask because, funny story, one time a salesman came in, and I thought he was buying secrets about the German Chancellor's security detail. You remember a few years ago when Castro got ill all of a sudden? You did that? Well, let's just say I was in Cuba at the time, on vacation. That was you? Shit, I heard about that. Bravo. So, Ronald Sun, huh? Hey, do you ever notice his name's an anagram for lard on guns? Ironic, isn't it? Hey, yeah. And, uh, considering that item posted a few years back in the Worldly Weekly, about that pig fat being used as an experimental bullet toxin, not a coincidence. You might be onto something there, Mike. I'll look into that for sure. Ronnie Sung, Ronnie Sung. What do you want to know, Mike? Personal demons, pants size, political capital, sexual proclivities, hmm? Actually, all of the above. But right now, I'm most interested in who might want Sun dead. Political assassinations? Yeah, those are fun. One time, I took out an entire soccer stadium just to kill the premier of Namidia. Hey, did you know at 400 miles an hour, soccer balls can decapitate people? I didn't. But Sung? Sure, sure. I can tell you this, Mike. There's a big conference coming up at the Grand Hotel. Sun's going to be there, along with a few dozen EU bigwigs and the like. So you're suggesting I infiltrate the hotel. Why? Taiwanese National Security Bureau is providing the security. You think those cats don't just have oodles of stuff on everybody who might want their boss dead? Hmm. Wouldn't be too hard to slip in and borrow some of that information. Knew that would appeal to you, Mike. Hey, give me a call when you head that way. I'd like to be in on this. You got it.